How's it going guys, RXXC here, and it's been a while since I uh, did a video. Um, uh, just from coming back from California, I immediately turned around the next weekend and went to Disney World. I uh, had a really good time, went to uh, Galaxy's Edge and stuff. Got some really cool like Star Wars stuff. So like, it was like a holocron and stuff, that's not Bakugan, so uh, ignore the noise. Excuse me, let's go. Shut up! Alright, um, anyway. Uh, <laughs> I Before all that happened... So this is like two to three weeks back. I actually had a custom Bakugan made. Um, well, I didn't have it made. Actually, uh, someone did it for me. Uh, and that is Hive State Bakugan. Uh, if you're not subscribed to his channel, uh, go ahead and do that. He's, he makes really high quality content. Um, he's got like a little set and everything. He, he does really good paint jobs, which you're about to see. I'm about to highlight. And then, um, sorry, I have like a little bit of a cold right now. Um... I'm also going to show you something that I worked on, so this is kind of like a little joint project between the two of us. Uh, but this is going to be uh, my first custom Bakugan designed for me. Uh, and uh, he did a really great job. Some of you have probably already seen the video on his channel. Uh, he did just a, a phenomenal uh, job. Uh, I'll, I'll link it down in the description for sure. Um, after this video, go watch that video and see what he did, because... Um, he, he really is a master at this thing. So I'm going to have some B-roll and stuff too, uh, up on the screen for you. But this is what, uh, he ended up with in the packaging. Uh, this little thing came off, but check this bad boy out. This is, move my mic a little bit. This is my custom Trox. All right. Our triple X Trox, if you will. <laughs> uh, he is insane i got this light right here it's kind of harsh but the b-roll helped me out um man i love it so much he kind of used the same colors from my matrix matte design uh he's got the blue eyes uh and that really comes out uh and shows up really well on that dark dark black and then he has like this metallic red paint on it and it it just brings everything out so cool because it's like metallic on matte uh and he like lined the edges of all the panels and stuff on it uh you can see it in that video um man it's crazy uh so uh, the reason it's on this little pedestal is because when trucks opens um those of you who use like trucks ultra uh would know um the legs kind of like rub up really tight uh around this area or um yeah so like his legs like roll around or whatever and they can really scrape that really bad um, and as he was doing the project, he, he just kind of messaged me. He's like, Hey, look, um, it's really kind of hurting what I'm doing. So, uh, we're, I want to ask you if you'd mind making it like a display piece. And I was like, heck yeah. Uh, so for now on my videos, this is going to be sitting in the middle of my name up here, uh, right on that X. It'll be sitting right there. Um, so this is kind of my new little mascot. Um, like I have my little drawing or whatever. Uh, but I'm about to show you what I did um, as a kind of a, um, an addition to this. Uh, basically, well, let's pull it up and I'll just show you. All right, guys, and this is it. This is Trox for uh, my uh, my new channel. I guess not new channel. It's the same channel. Um, I'm just moving forward. I want I want some more character to what I got and like what I can do with branding and stuff. So I took. Hive State's idea, and I took trucks, and I kind of put them into each other. So, this thing's been my phone background for three weeks, uh, so, um, I don't know. I really love this thing. It, it's kind of, like, ingrained in me already. Even for some of y'all, it's, like, the first time y'all seeing it. Uh, this is definitely, like, my guy. Like, I love this thing to death. The only thing I wish is that I could make it playable. So, I don't know. Maybe one day we can try again uh, Hive State and make it happen. Uh, but for now, I'm absolutely happy uh, just to have this in my possession. Uh, and it inspired me to do this thing. Um, I also have, uh, I did a Dragonoid in this style. Maybe this would happen. Let me pull that up. Yeah, so uh, here is the Dragonoid. Um, I like this one a lot. I don't know how it would ever happen into a real life model. So if someone wants to take the challenge, <laughs> um, I'll gladly, uh, you know, check out what you do. Uh, this is kind of the color scheme I came up with on Photoshop. 
um, kind of highlighted. He's got like these little like tiger stripes on his jaw. Uh, just some artistic liberties I took. Uh, and um, I don't know. I really liked him. The, the whole point is like the black with the red accents and the blue eyes and blue glowy parts. Um, so if y'all have like a bunch of free time over the Christmas break or something and you feel like maybe painting a Bakugan if you want it to be a Dragonoid, uh, you can try this if you'd like. Um, I really like it. Uh, but anyway, back to Trox. Um, thank you, Hive State. Uh, I... Uh, I love this thing. <laughs> I know uh, it's been a while and I didn't post this in time. Uh, and I hope you don't think that this was not appreciated because it's gorgeous and I really love it. Um, I can't, I really just can't get enough of it. I wanna, every time I show someone, they're like, no way. Yes, way. It's mine. <laughs> I love it so much. Uh, thank you, Hive State. Uh, thank you, everybody, for watching this. Please go check out Hive State's channel. He's done a Bakugan for Negative Legend as well. Uh, some of you may have seen it. I think he did a, a Darkest Garganoid and made it, like, metallic and, like, crazy looking. He does a great job. Um, also, he is currently working on a Deca Dragonoid from Armored Alliance. Uh, I got the little blank one that you've probably seen going around on other YouTubers' channels or whatever. Um, it was a blank Deca. Blank as in it was white. <laughs> and I had Dragonoid, and I was like, man, I know who could paint this. <laughs> So I sent it to Hive State. He's working on it now. So be on the lookout on his channel for that. Uh, if if I need to, I'll make a video on it. If not, I'd rather all that uh, you know attention go to his channel. Um, I'm just getting it back because I like his work. And I want a deck of Dragonoid that's painted really cool. So um, thank you guys for watching. Thank you, Hive State. I hope everyone has a Merry Merry Christmas. Um, it's the Christmas season over here, uh, school's out, so I'm relaxing, uh, having a good time already. This is actually my first day, my cat's having a good time, there she is. Uh, and hopefully I, I can pump some videos out over the break. Uh, I'm, I might have a little bit of a busy break, but um, 2020, uh, depending on how, how well Armored Alliance works out, man, uh, I should be doing just about the same. So if you guys like the content I make, uh, thank you. Uh, for returning uh, over and over again. Uh, we passed 3,000 subscribers. It was insane. Uh, and hopefully uh, we can have another great year. Uh, basically, if Armored Alliance does well, I think I'll do well. So um, if not, uh, I'll try something else. I like talking to you guys. Hopefully you guys like what we're doing. Um, 2020 might contain some Pokemon stuff. Um, I really like this little Dragomons game. <laughs> I don't know if y'all are into that kind of thing, but like Spin Master, if 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 you want me to talk about Dragomons, I, if you want to send me some Dragomons, I'm not gonna be mad, okay? <laughs> so just send them over. Um, but yeah, I keep rambling. Sorry, I haven't done a video in a while. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Please subscribe, like the video, uh, and give a comment about Hive State's work. Go visit his channel. Give him some love. Say it was from me. Uh, and uh, I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Merry Christmas.